In my eternal search for new shorts, I have turned to Hush, home of my original green shorts, uh, and I bought a load of stuff. Try on. It's my life at the moment. That wasn't supposed to happen. I feel as though we absolutely have to start with the shorts. Don't you think? It would be rude not to. Now I bet that these, oh, they feel too tight. These are gonna to be too tight. This is always my problem. Halfway in between two sizes. See, these feel snug. They're not impossible, but you know when you just, you've got into that phase of life where you don't want anything touching you. Particularly. Um, they're not tight, but I prefer to feel like I've got nothing on. <laughs> I like the shape though, they're good. See, look, it's got decent coverage. You can bend over for something and it's not gonna, it's not gonna flash anything. I think they're pretty good. I also bought them in uh, like an 80s stonewashed denim. I might have to keep both pairs. I thought this was quite cute. Just, oh my God, oh, so not used to having to, um, breathe in to do my shorts up anymore because they're all so massive and stretched. Quite like that little top. It's like a almost like a William Morris print. Oh my god, why have I got so much crap in my background? Excuse me while I move my bathroom caddy. Right, so denim shorts and then this flowery cami which is in a really soft jersey don't know what it'd be good for but surely something and it's got good bra strap coverage so maybe that's a key for let's try the shorts in the stone wash um, i am actually also living in constant fear that either the size of these, Ben or Charlie will go out onto the balcony, which is where they're storing lots of their building materials. And I've got two massive windows leading out. Of, oh, look, these can't be the same shorts because these are a 10 and they're really loose. I'm not sure about those. Oh my god, I bought so much stuff. I don't know what happened. I didn't think I'd get into this. Honestly, it's like a maniac has done this, um, this order. It's about 70 vest tops. I did need basics. I do seem to have ordered quite a few things in duplicates. I feel like that's a high rise t shirt, don't you? It's a pastel camo. Question you have to ask yourself is, will I wear it? And the answer to that for this one is no. And I'll tell you why not. It's clingy on the tummy and it reveals a side bra. So that's going back in the bag. This, however, I can really get on board with because I live in jeans and t-shirts and at least it's a step away from the grey t-shirt with a slogan that I wear 95% of the time. Different slogans, I've got many, um, but it's pretty much the same outfit. Got a knitted camo glittery vest. What are we thinking on this? I feel like these vest tops make more sense with, with my uh, smart jogging trousers, don't they? These are the ones that I've kept from the M&M try-on. But is that quite a nice slinky sort of slinky top? I like the way it hangs. But I've also got two more knitted ones. Hold on. No. That is um, it's never going to work. 
Look at the state of the side of my bra as well. <gasps> For those of you who liked the little puff sleeved t-shirt that I tried on from the Me and M haul, whatever you'd call it, um, I'm really into these little puff details. I just think that they make it a little bit more interesting, the top. So if you're looking for a black, long-sleeved t-shirt, just a bit of jersey, a basic, but you wanted something a bit extra with it, then this is really, really nice. It feels quite sort of thick, it's good quality. Um, it feels like it would wash quite well. And yeah, it's just, it's a real basic, you know, everything else about it is a long sleeve t-shirt, but it's just got that added little detail. So that's worth noting, I think. I'm not gonna go out and find a bra to suit this. It's just not gonna happen. And I shouldn't kid myself that it will happen. So it's going back on the pile. But, you know, it's a good cut. Or if you've got boobs that just stand up on their own still, then uh, good for you. And this could be a nice one it's all the rage isn't it this is all cut away making your shoulders look all sexy um not no not sure what i need do i need a brown vest top not sure it does my my coloring any massive favors and i've got so much more to try i have bought three different white shirt or something or others Oh, this is comfy and nice, soft, drapey. Okay, going in with the sarong skirt. This is just a recipe for disaster, this skirt, if you've got kids. Can you imagine? This would be dirty within four minutes, not even. It's probably dirty now just from being in this dust room. Well, this, this shirt just feels enormous, this one. It feels a little bit cumbersome. Do you find this one? Getting undressed and getting dressed again is very stressful. Look, I feel like this should be a chic moment, but to be quite honest with you, I just feel like I have been attacked by my laundry pile. It's suitable, isn't it? It's suitable for a lunch with granny. Reasonably generous around the boobs, if you're worried about that little cinchy bit. This was one of the main reasons I made a hush order. I thought it was really nice, this little contrast ribbon lace um, cami. I like the length, I like the fabric, and I like the contrast trim. And I'm wondering whether for this top I would venture into braless, not braless, strapless, strapless bra territory. I treated myself to some summer pyjamas. I like the fact they come in a little matching bag. Um, and I went for shorts. Is it me or is this shirt really big? I love the pattern, but I do feel a bit, I do feel a bit like I'm in somebody else's night clothes. Well, that's it for this try on. Definitely found my denim shorts. They'll do for the summer. I've got my camo t-shirt, a few other bits and bobs, but I am being very, very strict with myself. And only keeping things that I know I will wear all the time. All the time. Like the green shorts. Like what happened with the green shorts. Um, so let me know what you think in the comments and um, I'll see you in the next try on video. Let me know what brands as well. I was gonna do the Reformation with those dresses that um, like push your boobs up to here and make you look like you're from Bridgerton. So let me know if you would want that. It might be slightly X-rated. It doesn't bother people these days, does it? People wear thong bikinis on the beach. <laughs>